Istanbul court on Friday ordered the detention of a former deputy police chief of the Istanbul Police Department, Hamza Tassun, only a day after another court released him pending trial. If taken in custody, Tassun will be detained for the third time since July 2014, when a major government crackdown targeted the police force. Tassun's latest brief detention took place on May 19, after which he was released pending trial on Thursday. However, the prosecutor in the case opposed his release, demanding that he be detained. Bekir Altun, the judge of the Istanbul First Criminal Court of Peace, issued a detention order for Tassun. Osman Erdurk, a lawyer representing Tassun, commented on the court order on Twitter, saying, it seems like they won't be satisfied until they put him under arrest. What do you want from this man? Three judges issued decisions for his release, now we are going to appear before a judge. Damn your justice! Tassun, who was in charge of the financial crimes unit of the Istanbul Police Department, is accused of attempting to overthrow the government or prevent it from performing its duties. Tassun had previously been detained on September 1, 2014 as part of a large-scale government crackdown on the police force following the eruption of two major corruption scandals involving the government in December 2013. The officers who took part in the December 17 and December 25 investigation have been targeted by government control judges and prosecutors ever since. Tassun did not actively take part in the operations, but he is considered to be linked to the case because he was called by a colleague who was in the United States shortly before the raids. Tassun was released pending trial after his September detention. However, earlier this week he was detained again and questioned about the aforementioned call until 3 a.m. on Wednesday, then referred to court after a prosecutor demanded his arrest. The Istanbul court handling the case rejected the prosecutor's request and released Tassun pending trial after he had been interrogated. Tassun spoke to the Sahan news agency after his release, saying, I was incarcerated on coup attempt charges. I say the same thing that I said after my detention on September 1, may God curse those who attempted a coup. I would confront anyone plotting a coup. They asked me a lot of questions. Some of them were related to my phone calls. My phone conversations with my loved ones, family, and friends are considered a crime now. They deem some programs I downloaded to my smartphone evidence of a crime. My friends, don't ever download programs to your smartphones. Otherwise you might be charged with involvement in terrorist organizations.